Welcome to the Gospel of Luke. Today we're at Luke chapter 22, verses 24 to 27. Now there was also a dispute among them as to which of them should be considered the greatest. And he said to them, The kings of the Gentiles exercise lordship over them, and those who exercise authority over them are called benefactors, but not so among you. On the contrary, he who is greatest among you, let him be as the younger, and he who governs as he who serves. For who is greater, he who sits at the table or he who serves? Is it not he who sits at the table? Yet I am among you as the one who serves. So Jesus is at the table. This is the Last Supper. There they are, and they've been having a dispute about who's the greatest among them. Uh, very uh, disturbing, very, you know, very out of sync with what Jesus is trying to do. And so Jesus passes on one of the last lessons that he'll give them in their close, intimate connection. He says, it's not the, to be the way it is in the, in the human governments. It's not to be that way among you. The greatest among you will be a servant, just as I, I am the greatest among you. I, I'm, after all, God. I'm Messiah. I'm the greatest among you, but I'm here as your servant, and you should serve each other as you've seen me model serving you. And so there is a teaching, a very important teaching for the church. Whenever the authorities in the church get oh, overwrought when they, they think, they think they've got a lot of authority, you know, and they're going to say, this can happen, this can happen, this can happen, that can't happen, That's we're not going to allow that. And they always kind of exceed their authority at a certain time. And so, friends, we want to be right with God. We want to be careful that it, it, we don't ever get uh, elevation sickness, you know, like you get promoted to a higher position and you suddenly think you have all this authority over other people. Hey, the truth is the truth at the, at the bottom of the ladder or at the top. So let's support God's truth and God's mercies. And let's not ever get elevation sickness. Let's stay close. Stay close to the king. Let's pray. Dear Father in heaven, thank you for your goodness. We again look to you. We are expecting great things, not because of us, Lord, but because you. You are a great Lord. Help us to have your spirit. Help us to be humble and low, stay low to the ground and be true to Jesus all the time. Thank you for hearing our prayer. In Jesus' name we ask. Amen. All right, friends. The Lord... May his blessings be upon you this day.